All right, guys, we're back at it again for another um, dear Lord, please help those people. Um, we are back at it again for another grocery haul. Yay! Um, we went to super low this time, so. Yes, prices are a little different, but still. Um, first up, got trail mix. Um, it's the mountain trail mix that I personally like. It's the one, if y'all don't know what mountain trail mix is, it's pretty much the, it pretty much has peanuts, raisins, chocolate candies, almonds, and cashews. I like that personally. Um... I don't know, you have the sweet and the salty and everything right there. <laughs> um, next is... We got some of the... Or Ida wa uh, waffle fries. There. Um, then we also got some of the best choice Mexican style shredded cheese along with the uh, mozzarella shredded cheese. This is so that we can do um, pizzas again because apparently we like making homemade pizzas now. Yeah, they're pretty good. Yeah, they're pretty good. We're pretty good. Then I got another thing of pasta sauce. It's the best choice traditional mushroom. Best choice. Just <laughs> then two things of the Clausen sandwich sliced dill pickles uh, for sandwiches. But then we also like eating them without having to do all that. <laughs> Bottom shelf, baby. Or, or I was gonna say bottom shelf door, but that works. Um, and then we got a can of chunk pineapples by best by best choice, so that we can do uh, uh, a pineapple Hawaiian pizza. Hawaiian pizza type thing. Um, what else? Then we got a thing of pa of pizza sauce for the pizzas. And to update y'all as soon as we make pizza. We'll let y'all know as we make it. Yeah. <laughs> so, y'all know I'm now starting to do weekly um, foods. Um, this past week's been a whole lot, but like I said, when we do more, I'll show y'all and go from there. We also got this new marinade sauce. Well, it's wing sauce, but it says marinade. It's s'mores, marinades, and sauces, buffalo garlic wing sauce. We thought it would be good for a pizza or something spicy-ish. Maybe pizza or a barbecue or something. Yeah. It's like that type thing. Oh. Yeah. yeah. And then I'm running low on my Chick-fil-A sauce. But we got the Polynesian Chick-fil-A sauce. Um, to try out the difference between the two. So, yeah. Where is it in the fridge? Uh, it is on... Or did I literally just run out? No. It looks like I ran out, ran out. I think I ran out, ran out, yeah. Well, good. Well, we got some more. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> um, I wasn't a big fan of the other kind. Yeah. Next, we got two things of the Snickers uh, Coffee Mate Creamer. Y'all know we normally do the caramel macchiato 
and then I flavored. But <laughs> we decided to get two of the flavored this time. Hey, Nick, can you come get this salad? Yeah, okay. This is all frozen. It's frozen salad. It's a green frozen. I'll feed it to dog. He'll be, he'll eat it. You know? Yeah. Um, then, let's see here. We got a thing of crunchy peanut butter because I've been eating a lot of crunchy peanut butter here lately. Two things of the Nesquik, the Nestle Nesquik, if y'all don't remember the Nesquik chocolate milk. Yeah, we got it the syrup to make chocolate milk. Now, the funny thing is, is that Super Low had the Hershey's kind, but the Hershey's kind was more expensive than Nestle. It blew our minds. Well, yeah, it kind of blew our minds, so we were like, oh. Okay, we're going with Nestle instead. I was like, no wonder my father. Yes, my dad. The dad that I don't have, that I don't talk to a lot. Yeah, he used to got he used to get it a lot when I was a kid. It's a long story. Yeah, that's a long story. Um, next thing is habanero sauce. Yeah. Um. So so that another thing for something spicy, for when we do it. Um, two things of the fluffy, thin, uh, sliced bread. Like I said, we got two of them. Since we do go through a lot of bread. Breads. Um. We keep our breads in the fridge. Yeah, we keep the fre bread in the fridge. It a lot fresh longer. Yeah. Next is our medium 18 eggs um, because we had to throw away our two and a half dozen due to it being old well, and it frozen. Was, yeah, half of them are frozen, so I'm going to kind of keep them up toward, closer to the front of it so don't freeze. Um, then we got two different... Cereals. We got the malt, the malt a meal version of Fruit Loops, Fruit Loops right. with marshmallows, but they call it the Tutti Fruities with marshmallows. And then, of course, my generic of uh, the malt meal mini spooners, which is pretty much mini wheat. Then we got two things of milk this time. Um, the last thing of milk that we got obviously doesn't go out till the the fourth of December, but it's almost gone. Yeah, it's really almost gone. So we got two because we knew we would like get milk and we drink it. Drink it a lot, and plus the cereal. Um, so we have one that literally expires on my boyfriend's birthday. And one that expires two days after. <laughs> but yeah, we just drink a lot of milk, so it makes sense to get two more. There, we got milk. Um, and then, what is pizzas without. Pizza crust. Pizza crust. It's, ooh, it wants to say stuff on that. It's the um, Mama Mary's Thin thin and Crispy Pizza Crusts. We got two of them, and there's normally like two, two per, package. per package. Yeah. So that's like four pizzas right there. I'm going to cook two pizzas at a time anyway. Yeah. Um, next up is, looks like, Veggie. Veggie. So I have breaded okra and it's the um, southeastern vegetables along with their um, fajita blend so that we can make stir fries and put it on the pizza. 
And then Brussels sprouts. Mmm, good stuff. Um, then now I have some baby mushrooms. They're sliced so that we can put them on the pizzas really good. Here you go. Um, then we have pumpkin pie so that we have something sweet in here at the house. Um, and then we have we got the best choice sliced cheese for sandwiches. We got some Land of Forest sliced chicken meat for sandwiches, along with the um, oven roasted turkey from the same brand. And then we got Bariella. Uh, noodles, the medium shells, and the rotini. Even though we have like four. We try to keep stock on it. But yeah, we try to keep stock on it because we like making pasta. Mm. Then I got some sausage and biscuit from the Tennessee Pride. There's like 20 of these. But depending on where you go, it depends if either A, you have it, or B, you got a 12 count and a 20 count bag. You're not bigger, depending on, like I said, where you go and if you have it or not. Yeah, um, and then we got pizza rolls. Best choice brand. The best choice brand, and it's the um, combination. We kind of keep combination on us for, prefer for food preferences, really. Yeah. Um, oh, then we got sausage, and then some peppered gravy for when we make these country fried steaks. steaks. Yeah. Um, we also got jalapenos for um, pizza and whatever, pizza and whatever else we want. Else we And then last in this bag, because then we have one more bag, and then I got other stuff to show y'all. Um, potatoes. Potatoes go in the back, the bucket under the microwave. Oh, under the microwave. Okay. Last bag. Woohoo! Um, then we got. Then we got some more. Then we got these beef minute steaks that we're going to use for, um, Country fried steaks. Yeah. That's very country fried. And then we got these chicken tenderloins. Now this one I know it shows us how much we pay for it. So $14.73 for these chicken tenderloins. And it was 2.27 pounds. Make that stretch. Yeah, we're gonna make that stretch. We also got <laughs> Then we got some sliced bacon, again for pizza or for um, whatever else. This is the Williams Hickory Smoked Sliced Bacon. Uh, it's pretty much been a Tennessee thing since 1958, apparently. And then last in the meat is um, some... Boneless beef short rib, beef short ribs. We paid seven dollars and sixty nine cents for a pound and oh, yeah, one point ten pound. But it's enough for a meal. Yeah, it's enough for a meal. And then obviously we got um so yeah, we pretty much got a a forty pound of dog food. Ooh, there. A 40 pound of dog food for $20. Uh, Ben's oh. best. Yes, the food. Ben's best dog food. It was either that or a 30 pound for the same price. And then, of course, we got our drinks. I can do it. There we go. Then we got our drinks. We got the 24 count Dr. Pepper. 
and the 24 can of Coke. All together, we spent about $257.22. We're getting better at this whole trying to find what we want and slash meal prep thing and try to spend less. Other than that, I shall see y'all later. Bye. Oh, oh, and I'll show y'all what we're going to have throughout the week so that y'all can get a gist of what, of what we do for meal prepping. Anyways, bye. Oh boy.